Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Brandon Buckalo, and this is the Review Chair Uncut. Thank you for tuning in. I'm going to do a trailer reaction and review for The Visit from M. Night Shyamalan. I'm pretty excited about this one. I like M. Night's work. Alright, guys, you ready? Here we go. Swerve. Every day, it's getting close. Are you holding my camera properly? Swerve, girl. Uh, Stop, both of you! I'm, uh, my parents asked if their grandchildren could visit them for a week. Here we are. This is where our mom grew up. I've wanted to spend time with you for so long. Miss you guys! Oh. Oh. We're having a great time. I have not seen your nana this far. This feels like a family years. movie. Bedtime here is 9.30. We all know that's you not the case. best you two should come out of your room after that. See you in the morning. Is it like a haunting? Overgeist? What is that? It's 10.47. We think there's someone outside the door. Holy shit! What was that? Even the little kid said only hill. I think Nana's not feeling well. Grandmother's fine. It's like somebody talking in their sleep. Yeah, that looked awesome. Uh, they were here during the day. They're just cleaning it. And even later at night? Mom, there's something wrong with Nana and Papa. They're just old. Bear with it for a couple of days. Oh, oh crap, they're gonna go crazy. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> That's chilly. And the producer of Paranormal Activity. Okay, okay. It's just the end of your trip. He's just the money man. I'm sad. It's all over. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, I see where he's going. Let's make it a perfect night. Oh, my God. You need to come right now. Would you mind getting inside the oven to clean it? Oh, shit! Grandma, no! Mm. An original thriller. Yeah, I'd call that a thriller. Man, that was pretty chill. Like, I'm excited to see this movie. There was a couple parts at the beginning of it where I was like, ah, this is the happening all over again with freaking Mark Wahlberg, which I liked. It was a good movie, but it's like, I don't want him to do the same shit over again. I think M. Night could have gone a different direction than to do a movie like this, because he's very talented as a writer and director, and I mean, his movies like Sixth Sense and personally, I love The Village. It's just really, really imaginative. And both of those films are very far apart from genres, in my opinion. And uh, I mean, I guess they're both scary thriller types, but I mean, one's a scary ghost, uh, like a kid that sees ghosts and shit, and the other one was like a village in the middle of nowhere that they went away from normal society, and I just love that idea. I mean, this looks good, because I liked how they went with, uh, you know, all of a sudden the, the, the grandma and the grandpa just start, like, freaking out, and that's, like, everybody's worst nightmare, right? To, to go over to grandma and grandpa's, and they just freaking, like, start tripping out on you, and I don't know where he's going with, like, what made them like that, but, uh, that kind of makes it exciting. Like, I kind of want to see it now to see, like, what's going to go on and uh, what makes them go crazy. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, M. Night, I think what he's trying to do with this, because uh, apparently, and a lot of people don't know this, M. Night Shyamalan uh, wrote and directed uh, After Earth with Jaden Smith and uh, Will Smith. And, uh, apparently, uh, I heard that it didn't do very well, so, uh, which is crap, because I love that movie. I 
mean, I'll even give props to Jaden Smith, because there's some scenes in there where he's really emotional and does a really good job, a really good performance, so he's definitely an actor to watch out for. I mean, he's got it in his genes, so we should expect a lot of good things from him. And, uh, but I think that it didn't do well, and I think he's trying to redeem himself. If you notice, there's not any big-name actors in this movie. And I think what he's hoping for is that it does well, and that he can just be like, oh, well, look, my stories are good. I am a good director, and this movie did well without any big names in it. So, um, let's all t go see this to support M. Night Shyamalan. And, I mean, who cares that there aren't any big actors in it? And, uh, that's basically all I had to say. Uh, I think, uh, it looks very chilling, so it would be a good word for it. You saw me get some shivers. But, um, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Well, that was my reaction and review. And, uh, once again, I'd like you, uh, to thank you again for tuning into this channel. And uh, go ahead and uh, click subscribe if you like this video. There's going to be a lot more trailer reactions to come. And uh, I'll see you guys next time.